Namaste beautiful yogis, welcome to Ali Kamanova Yoga, I'm Ali and today we're doing a class from the new October program called Quantum Yoga and this program will be unique, it will be new and different and my vision for it is to be a program that's tapped into the energies of the year but something evergreen that we can always come back to especially in deep transformative times and we are going to do a class a warm-up only and after that we're going to do a silence movement i'll show you the movement and then it's going to be repetitive in silence and with music so you're going to get in the zone and there's going to be no talking for that the big segment of the class you're going to get sweaty it's going to be classic vinyasa today uh, for other classes it will be different things but will bring intensity and everything can be uh, modified for any level so that this class can serve anybody but it can be difficult for advanced people and it could be challenging for beginners <laughs> but just to challenge a little bit so we really raise the heat and prepare the body for meditation i'll give you moves that are good for meditation that are conducive prepare the body the channels so that we can see it and really uh, uh, travel inward into the inner space and uh, after that i'm gonna go into a meditation and i invite you to come to that meditation if you have time right after the class if not come back to it in the evening on your weekend whenever you have the time it is going to be themed meditations um, kind of how we did them on the workshop and i'll do the same in the future workshops but we're going to tackle all these transformative subjects especially october is time when nature deals with the death of everything the leaves are dying on the ground and it's that feeling of death in the air so we're going to work through the energies and now pluto is so active pluto is the big transformative energy in the astrology um, energetics so we're going to work on different subjects face your shadow is today's class but we're going to have different themes deep transformation um, staying in uh, higher frequencies um, when the external is chaotic contemplating death so there is freedom from the fear and fears and traumas and all of that we're going to work on different subjects if you have any suggestions for themes now is the time to post the requests in the comments and i will um, i will select beautiful themes that are very inclusive for um, anything that you might be working through and transformation is always important facing the shadow integrating the shadow is really important integrating it and being embodied so with all of that being said i invite you to join me on my membership the entire program in its entirety will be on there here i'll come how I've been coming on once or twice a month right now my schedule is at that but it, it will vary in the future but for now there's going to be a few classes on here and I invite you to flow with strength and ease starting at the front of the mat and we're gonna take steps back and forth and circle the arms back and you can circle them forward and backward starting to feel the back muscles the upper back starting to focus on the breath gonna shift side to side tracing the hands with your eyes always including the eyes the eyes are very important when we're inducing a meditative state when we want to switch the brain from beta into the other theta alpha delta frequencies the eyes can always help 
or their big toe and from here we're gonna do big scoops so imagine you're scooping water from the bottom scoop and reach and scoop and as if you're pouring water over yourself now use your entire body this is warm-up and reach and scoop and reach and scoop and reach great let's inhale reach and here i will invite you as you reach up clasp the hands and reach over to one side to soften the gaze i've been using this tool consistently for my meditations and you don't have to close the eyes it is this soft gaze as if you're simultaneously seeing this reality and also sourcing from the energy source prana plasma etheric layer so softening the eyes and, and as if as if you're meditating you're not trying to see everything and just observe with the brain you you're getting input so that if you're present but at the same time you're gazing beyond beyond just this maybe in, into the yeah into the air and exhale down so keep the eye action from here on Plank, Chaturanga, Up Dog, Chaturanga, Down Dog. Take the right leg up, open the hip, lift the knee, bring the leg behind and lift the hips while pin. lengthen, open, lift. And side plank and we're gonna do alternating knee tucks first the right knee then the left knee right left six seven eight nine ten and with an arch rainbow exhale Plank, Chaturanga, Up Dog, Chaturanga, Down Dog. Take the left leg up, open the hip, drop it behind, lift, arch, expand, breathe, soften the gaze. As if you're drinking through the eyes, the cosmic man, the man of the future human of the future will be sourcing prana way more efficient than we are through the cells through the eyes side plank and we're gonna do one two three alternating four five six seven eight nine ten Arch, and as you bring both hands down in plank, bring your right knee in and across, and shift your weight onto the right hand, and lift here in a kind of side plank, meets wild thing, meets triangle type of think opposite side cross it and just open push through the feet push through the heart through the chest the hands lengthen the back of the neck feel the hips lighten lighten up and exhale all right a few plank knee tucks so bring the right knee in and across to the left left to the right right middle left left middle right a few more of those step at the front chair come up exhale the hands and now pay attention because this is going to be the drill for the day 
you are just gonna repeat it if you mess it up a little bit no big deal just flow with it make sure to breathe through it once I show it to you I'll stop talking so that we can really go in the flow of things I want to give you a little bit of everything in this month silence intensity movement inhale reach exhale dive you will be going at your own pace inhale look ahead pull the belly in really feel here connection plank chaturanga chaturanga down dog inhale the right leg up step it through twist right hand comes up and feel that twist and come all the way up reaching through the left fingertips bring the hands in prayer and complete the twist with elbow to opposite knee exhale in here and release step it back vinyasa opposite side reach up step it through twist once you're done here come up you're gonna feel when you're done reach and lift this is really elongating very beneficial move one more beneficial move and release down vinyasa down dog take the right leg up step it through and come into warrior two reverse the warrior side angle lower the knee stretch here for a very brief moment when you consciously bring your awareness to where you're stretching short moments in the flow the motion are very beneficial opposite side same thing take the left leg up step it through warrior two hold it for a moment feel it reverse it make it into a dance side angle really lengthen and stretch it out Down dog. And step at the front. Forward fold. Inhale, come up. Exhale. Hands over the heart. And with that, we'll begin. You can look at me for the first rep if you forget something and then you pretty much remember it or you can watch it again the intro we have the twisting sequence on each side and then the warrior two sequence on each side that's it and we can come at the front in between each set and we'll do that for exactly 20 minutes so i'll stop talking now and stay in here just flow and breathe and stay in here in the body and enjoy i'll see you for the meditation after
down, stretch it all down. I hope you're feeling joints lubricated, everything moving, everything really awakening the body in the emotional mental bodies. Etheric. Inhale, reach. Exhale, dive down. Inhale, look ahead, plank. Step your right foot on the outside of the mat here and step your left foot on the outside open the left arm here a few more of those every class I'll do will be completely different moves really gonna get to work and focus on how the ball the poses Feel in the body and sit down for a double or single pigeon, however you want to do it, and breathe. And change sides. Let's bring the right foot on the outside of the left knee, left knee on the ground, reach. So right foot, left arm, reach up and exhale the elbow on the outside. And we worked quite a bit on the torso and the twist, so I hope you're feeling it. And deepening. In this series with each new pose, as we repeat them, you feel a different level of depth. The integration of the pose. 
stack the knees on top of each other. Lean forward, again, hip opener here. Exhaling through the hips. Great. Coming up, you can do the fancy walking around onto your toes. Shift and let's start with now the opposite knee, left knee over. Leaning forward, feel the hips, flex the feet. right arm reach and exhale so some of the classes this month are gonna have shorter meditation lower, longer stretch and some will have shorter stretch longer meditation but the stretch will be included in the, the sequence because it requires a lot of bit a lot of flexibility to really move through the vinyasa inhale forward and let's Stretch forward. Inhale up. Bend the knees and we're gonna, as if we're scooping, lean back and come forward. Lean back. So here we're gonna move the body straight and really connect to the core. That's finishing touches here. from the core program. From September. And I'll invite you to sit comfortably in a comfortable position. And we'll continue with the meditation. If you need to lean back, lay, you can also do a walking meditation with the eyes open and in a safe area, of course, with that gaze of softer gaze, tuning into the pranic layer. Or if you're seated, if you're laying, you can close the eyes partially or completely. And let's bring the index and thumb together. And begin to deepen the breath. We're going to go into a brief breath of fire, Palabhati breath. So rapid breathing through the nose, pumping as if you're pumping air and you're involving your entire abdominal wall in that action. And begin to see a swirling light energy in the third eye. Whirling through the third eye inward. Beginning to see your body seated here, almost from a different perspective as you shift your gaze inwardly inward you're beginning to see things from a new perspective and let's bring the right hand on to the nose with the thumb we're gonna close the right nostril we're gonna use index and middle finger to close the left and thumb to close the right and we're gonna start with closing the right nostril and exhaling on the left and 
then inhaling on the left. Closing the left, opening the right, exhale. Inhale. Closing the right, exhale through the left. Inhale. Close right. Inhaling. Close and continue. And we'll begin to breathe through the root chakra. Inhaling and exhaling through there. And seeing as if our energy is extending deep into the center of the earth. A beautiful connection to Gaia. A powerful connection and protection assistance and as you breathe see yourself within a beautiful crystal red sphere a beautiful perfect red color crystalline crystal pure unbelievably beautiful red the most pure red you've ever seen. And continue breathing through your root chakra, seeing that beautiful red sphere, a color you've never seen before, that awakens the connection to Gaia within you, a nurturing, mothering, feminine energy, assisting you to grow here, to expand, to use the human condition in order to evolve the soul. And slowly see that sphere of red, beautiful, as if it is a crystal color. Red shifting into a beautiful golden orange very golden color maybe speckled something you've never seen before something from fantasy land something from that you can draw from in your imagination from art from the crystal kingdom maybe something beautiful Inhaling into second chakra, below the belly button, lower belly. I'm feeling the sphere connected to that lower belly chakra. physically creative center magical energy here mm -hmm. 
and slowly see that beautiful yellow uh, orange sphere shifting into beautiful yellow a sparkling yellow color and it has a crystalline quality to it connecting to your solar plexus the sphere is connected to the solar plexus allowing you to really express your identity on this plane Continue breathing as you see the details of the yellow color. Maybe there is a pearlescent quality to it. Maybe there is a shimmer to it. Maybe it's built out of sunlight. really breathe and see and feel that color that's fear as a part of you as an extension of you something reflective of you connected to you slowly see that yellow shifting into green and shifting into the heart breathe into the heart in and out of the heart from the back and the front side of the body see a vortex coming in through the heart from the cosmos towards the heart, connecting to that green sphere that's containing you, everything that you are. Emotional protection. And see that vortex that's connecting you to the love principle in the universe. To the Christ consciousness. To the infinite love. And it's a vortex that spins and it brings energy in and it carries energy out from you into the universe and from the universe into your heart and you're able to freely give and receive and it's flowing effortlessly beautifully and the green color is crystallizing into the most beautiful emerald green you've ever seen. Maybe something you've never seen. Something you see for the first time. See the details. Feel them. Bring the details into your consciousness. Bring the consciousness of that green into your own consciousness. And feel an expansion. 
as if your body is expanding. The layers of your body, your light bodies, are vibrating powerfully. Slowly begin to see that green color shifting into a beautiful ocean green blue. A gorgeous, vibrant color. The sphere is in this beautiful blue color, but ocean greenish elements to it. And it's flowing like water with waves, beautiful calm waves, and you're within it, contained within it, connected to the throat, creative center connected to higher consciousness, expression of the divine here on earth. In images, words, communication. Sound. And feel that watery, oceany, wavy blue flowing all around you in a sphere of unbelievably beautiful blue and that water carries within itself within its memory body, the earth element, as it is forever connected with the earth, with the ground, with the soil, with Gaia. In the memory body of the water, there is the earth. And in the waves, there is the air in continuous play dance and in the spaces between the molecules there is the ether prana containing it all and keep breathing through the throat through the throat center scan the throat see if it's spinning if it's vibrant if it's connected give it love if it needs love vortex energy in it needs to be cared for, started up, healed, balanced out. Feel your connection to the divine creative expression. You're continuously connected to that divine creativity. Always able to source, to download, to bring that divine creativity, divine messages here on earth through your own art, through your communication, 
music, writing, speaking, being. you breathe, feel it spinning. Keep pouring that blue, beautiful, unique color energy in there, into the throat center. Fifth chakra. slowly see that blue turning into deep lapis lazuli royal blue connecting to your third eye with golden speckles in it just like in the crystal lapis beautiful royal blue rich saturated color earthly yet with an ephemeral quality as if you're able to see a new level in bl of blue with your eyes your eyes opening to new layers of color new frequencies of color and feel the energy in your third eye spinning a vortex continuously connected to the universe to the cosmic flow through the purity of your own heart being able to see beyond just the visible field into the timelines of the future and the past that all meet here in this moment to see subtleties to hear in images the voice of the soul get messages about things that concern you that you need in order to expand to evolve to fulfill your mission your purpose your reason to be here at this time to see and feel more of the divine to embody it take a breath in see your sphere shifting into a beautiful purple and it has the quality of water in it it is connected to your crown it has beautiful big surfable waves that are almost built out of fire. Yet there is no conflict. Water and fire are somehow dancing in the same vision, carrying the memory of the earth, and the power of air in the form of wind, whispers. with the ether containing it all being the element 
that bridges the world of ideas to the world of form. And feel your crown spinning, connecting, lifting up, out into the cosmos. Beautiful vortex into the cosmos. Into the universal consciousness. Spinning that chakra allowing the flow of energy in and out, sourcing from the universal consciousness, from the ocean of consciousness, and putting out love and beauty, putting it out into that ocean of consciousness. Above your head, another energy center in your body, in your lighter body, outside of the physical, above the head, a golden sphere. That sparkles, almost like light where it contains all the colors in a beautiful dance. There's purples and blues and greens and oranges dancing in a beautiful harmonious movement. rose gold string extending from your top chakras into the core of the universal consciousness you're always able to tune in Connect to source. Take a break. Connect when you need, you're so comforted. When you feel weak. When you need help. Encouragement. When you're serving. It, it allows you to serve from the highest self. It is a beautiful rose gold cord. always there for you when you need it.
that vortex at the top of the head. And see yourself shrunken down to an atom, being as small as you can imagine yourself to be in that vortex. Ready. Vortex yourself in into the space of the head, finding yourself inside that space, and notice that you're in a space where there is a lot of different areas and rooms and pathways and one is in the third eye and it is quite complex there is different areas there so start walking on one of the paths and see in the distance a few doors and see which one you want to open and as you approach that door look down at your hands and reach out towards the door and open it and as the door opens take a moment inhale and slowly enter and take a look around to find yourself in a cosmic room almost as if the walls are made of constellations and the ceiling is made out of deep space there is a humming sound sound of the void and all of a sudden realize that there is a figure one of the corners ends of the room and slowly walk up to it to her to him to them to realize that it is a mirror image of you but somehow it doesn't look like you it has its own look, she, he. It is a light body built out of light. And reach with your hands out towards that being. to grab their hands, to look down at them, to hold them, and to stand here for a moment, feeling the energy between the two of you. And she is neither fully female or fully male. She is not androgynous.
She is a being. That in some ways is you and in other ways it is something else. She contains all the feminine and masculine qualities that we're aware of here on earth and something beyond that field. And she holds and guards all the feelings, emotion, thoughts, memories. That you have set aside and ignored. She's brave because she chooses to contain them until you're ready. So now you can sit down and bring your hands into your lap. she sits across from you and you see this vortex of golden light through your heart into hers and from hers into yours and it is a stream of continuous energy unconditional love ineffable love compassion understanding willingness to be there for you To guard your heart. And now you can look at her and them. And see her shifting. Into an emotion that you deny yourself, but yet it is within you. But you deny accepting it and loving it. See her shifting into things that you're ashamed of, guilty of, you consider ugly. Parts of yourself that are dark, fearful, angry, hateful. 
see her take that shape. And as you hold space for her, let her know that you love her unconditionally. And see her morph into a different emotion. Something hidden. into your deeper psyche something forgotten abandoned uncared for and contain it in a sphere of love as if she's your child and you're gonna love her no matter what. See her morph into yet another emotion, thought, feeling, and create a crystal sphere of love that extends from your heart and holds her safe in that emotion. And let that emotion play out until it transforms, until it is released, absorbed, maybe absorbed into the earth. And as you hold her in that sphere of love, yourself breathing through the root chakra all the dark energy releasing it into the earth and creating crystalline space crystalline body Continue breathing it out, exhaling into the earth, releasing as if you're releasing fog into the earth, cloudy energy, and as you inhale crystalline, energy comes in. it is time for you to go so as you say thank you you ask her any question you need to ask her and become receptive for the answer whether it is words or a message something that you will integrate here later or now and 
and see if she has any message for you anything she needs to tell you And it is getting closer to the time that we need to leave. So as you're looking at her in the last moments of this meeting, see her absorbing the sunlight, becoming almost as if she's a diamond structure. And as you look at her, beautiful, sunlit, absorbing the sun, absorbing the light, realize that she is you, the denied parts of you, the ones that were not allowed to grow, to expand to bathe in the sun, to transform. And as you're getting ready to go back to the door and leave, feel that you're always welcome to come into this space for further work if needed. for peaceful contemplation even for celebration for anything that you feel that you need to come back for and you can get up and start walking towards the door look down at your shoes or feet as you walk And as you approach the door, look at your hands and reach out to grab the door handle and to open the door. And with love streaming out of your heart, smile and exit the room. And take a breath and feel more of yourself right now than before more parts of yourself integrated into you and as we integrate part integrate parts of ourselves we're able to transform them we embody the soul we become whole slowly walk down the path that took you to that door until you reach that vortex and spin yourself out of the vortex up above the head And realize that at the end of that vortex that is connected to your crown chakra the whole universe is there the entire cosmos the entire universal consciousness is as little as this vortex and somehow as big as infinity and slowly see yourself as this little particle expanding out 
and becoming you. And bring yourself back into this room in your body and feel your body, feel the room. Take a breath in, rub your hands into each other. Maybe massage your hands briefly. Place your hands over the heart. And in prayer over the third eye. And blink your eyes open. And smile. And remember to flow with strength and ease into your day. Namaste.